Number 25. The diagram shows a section through part of the human eye. What takes place when a person looks at an object which is far away, far away from their eye. Uh, okay, far away from his or her eye is better. I think it's grammatically correct. But uh, anyways, um, so yeah, far away from the eye. Um, so what happens is that when we're looking at an object, the light enters our eyes or eyes, and it's going to penetrate the lens and it gets refracted. And then it's going to arrive or land on the back of the eye. And that part is called retina. So when the light enters our eye, it gets refracted and the light should be focused in same point in order to see the image like or images clear and crisp so the lens has to become thicker or thinner in order to refract more or less so this adjustment in the shape of the lens in order to focus the light coming from the object or environment is called accommodation. Okay, so lens becoming thicker or thinner is called accommodation. So this question is asking what happens to the to the to the uh, suspensor ligaments and lens when a person is looking at an object which is far away. So in order to see, or in order to see the, uh, the image cl clear and crisp, we have to, the person has to bend the light less. You see, if the light is coming from a very close distance, then, then the lens has to become thicker because it now has to refract the light more. However, if a person is looking at, a, looking at an object that's from very, very far away, then the lens has to become thinner because it refracts less. You see, the angle is greater here. If the person was looking at a close object, the light comes from the close distance. And then you can see the sh the, this sharp angle here, which means the lens has refracted the light much more. So this is the lens part. And that's where the light comes from. So, in order to change the shape of the lens, um, what has to happen is that the lens is connected to a muscle called, oops, that's too big. Lens, lens is connected to a muscle called ciliary muscle. And the lens is connected to the muscle by a ligament called suspensor ligament. Okay. So these these ones. Okay. That's that. So what has to happen is that lens is initially very thick. So in order to make it thinner, what we have to do is we have to expand it, like pull it, just, just pull it hard. And then it's going to become thinner like this. Okay. So the ciliary muscle has to relax. Then it's just going to expand itself and just at the same time pull 
these ligaments. So they, these ligaments will also be pulled and then the lens will be pulled in every direction and it's going to become thinner like that. So the suspensory ligaments will become tightened. It's going to become tightened because ciliary muscle is expanding and ciliary muscle is connected to ligaments and the ligaments are connected to lens to the lens. So the lens will become thinner. Hence the answer is D.